thought I'd give you a little tour of Stornoway Way 18. This is my galley box, which I keep all my cooking gear in. Uh, got the original idea from Roger Barnes and his Dinghy Cruising Association. And then uh, Arwen's Meanderings, another YouTube channel, they had plans. So I took those plans and I adapted them. And this is what I ended up with. So it's simply a box made out of six mil ply, ordinary ply, not marine ply. And I had some old Oregon, so I used that just to make edgings and handles around the side. So that it's just held on by friction. It's a tight fit. Take that off. I've got two front panels. They're held in at the bottom, there and there. So the height was determined by the distance under the seat and also my Aldi camping kit, uh, which had to fit in there. Unfortunately, it doesn't fit exactly when you put the little burner on top, so normally I unscrew it and store it separately. The metal foil is about $19 from uh, Bunnings. Just gives some heat protection from the wood. I've got a little box on the top, which you can store stuff in. Uh, a little light, there's my dehydrated meals. Under that I've got another shelf. You've then got a third compartment underneath. And lift out should you want to remove it. At the back there's another compartment which has got toothbrushes, cooking oil, that sort of thing in a camping bag. Toothpaste, you name it. And then I made a little draw down here to put the cutlery in. It's a bit of a tight fit because it's got to get between there and the edge of the cylinder. Um, it does work just. So to put it together I made a plan, made sure all the pieces were the right height. Then I glued the side panels and the vertical panels to the base. Then I cut internal pieces to join it together. And this is all glued and screwed. I tried to minimize the number of screws just for weight. When you're not using it as a lid, it's a really good tray because it's got a big lip on it. it stops you losing stuff. You can always carry a spare cylinder. So the hole in the base here supports this. So that's what it looks like when the cooker's on. I've just made a piece of wood to sit here just to stop it falling off. Because the last time uh, when I was up at Lake Macquarie, the boat came past, the whole lot fell off onto the floor and I lost my dinner. So I'm just going to uh, start to rehydrate my dinner. I've got a dehydrator at home. Uh, when I used to go camping, weight was really important. I've just carried on the habit. So this is um, some sort of beans concoction with meat. It's been dehydrated uh, and then stored in the fridge. It's probably a year old. Um, once you rehydrate them and heat them up, that tastes great. So yeah, that's my galley box. Uh, cheap, simple, Perfective.